Weighing them. <laughs> that shit is cold. Weighing them a buzz like. I'm trying to stay away from um, gymnastic over here. You feel me? Nowadays, as a man, y'all gotta watch yourself, cause you know, with all this feminist movement going on, it's fucking up niggas' game and shit. You feel me? Let's go, baby. You know what I mean? Cause me, I like to flirt, you feel me? I like to flirt with a woman. I love to flirt with a woman. I love to have a conversation with a woman, you know what I mean? I think it's sexy to have a conversation with a woman and take it all the way there. Flirt back and forth, get a little naughty. Feel me? Girls like that shit too. But nowadays it's just, you know, it's a thin line, you feel me? It's a thin line. I don't want that on my record, you feel me? I just don't. Like, I don't want that. When I say record, I mean my conscience. You feel me? I don't want to have a conversation with somebody who don't want to have a conversation with me. You feel me? It's the same thing as having sex with somebody who don't want to have sex with you. To me, that is uh, worrisome. So, you feel me? But now with all this feminist movement going on, you don't know what is what, so you just got to be careful. So it's taken away from the game. It's taken away from the way people speak sometimes. Like, men are very cautious about like this. And I'm telling you, I got to be cautious. You feel me? You still got to be on your A game. So no means no, you know what I mean? I know sometimes you like, no, it could be make no. No literally means no nowadays. Like, it's not like she's like, N I don't know. And she said, I don't know. That's it. Like, you know, just take your hands off. Feel me? You know what I mean? That's it. You know what I mean? It's over. Chop your hand off. Like, I didn't have no hands, officer, when I touched it. <laughs> For real. That's how crazy this shit is becoming nowadays. You feel me? You first got you gotta act concerned, like concerned. What is it concerned? Whatever they call it. You like, hi, can can I touch your shoulder? Then from there you be like, can I touch your can I take your shirt off? Like you gotta ask all the way. I know it gets corny and most girls it's an, it's amazing. Woman's nature. That woman won't want you to take control over the situation and everything else. But due to the situation at hand, you gotta ask each and every way, all the way. Can I put it in now? You gotta, yo, I know it's corny, but yo, you just gotta be. You gotta ask all the way through, all the way through. You feel me? Can I? Is it okay to give you a kiss here, right? You feel me? You gotta, you gotta ask all the way through. Even after COVID, you still gotta be like six feet back, please. Like, you feel me? Like, you gotta, like, you gotta do it, bro. Like, you don't know. Especially if it's a stranger, you feel me? Even if it's not a stranger, nowadays, 10 years later, they're still filing cases. So, you just got to be careful. I be on my... I be a... Nigga. They talking about... He... It look like he's... I'm like desperate, nigga. I'm not even desperate yet. I'm moving with caution. They see me talking to a bitch. I'm like, who else am I supposed to talk to? But I'm not talking to them like the way I used to talk to them. You feel me? I mean... You feel me? I don't like I just be I be very very cautious of the way I move nowadays. I be like, yo, nah. You feel me? You got to be cautious, bro. Especially it's a stranger, you feel me? You got to be like, "Hi, how you doing? Can I have a conversation with you?" You got to be very diligent in how you move. It sounds so corny and it sounds like girls don't even like that. Girls want you to be assertive. Facts. But you don't want to be assertive to, assertive to the point where you assuming the person that you're talking to is not going to do that. you just taking precaution, man. Fuck how they look at you. You know who you are. If you're alpha, you're alpha. All these names, red pill, alpha. Oh, Lord, have mercy. You feel me? All that shit is not going to work nowadays with all this red pill shit and all the alpha shit. With all this feminist movement. It doesn't seem like it's slowing down either. You feel me? It's not slowing down. So you want to be an alpha all you want. You want you be aggressive all you want, my nigga. And that shit ain't going to work with saying females. Because they're going to be like, I told him no and he grabbed me. He was very aggressive. I'm like, damn. Like, you complaining. Like, it's in a man's nature to be aggressive. Like, you feel me? It's in a man's nature to be assertive. It's in a man's nature to be bold and firm. 
Like, you feel me? How else am I supposed to talk to a woman? I want to approach her with a boldness. I want to approach her with confidence and a little bit of cockiness, like I'm sure of myself. With all this feminist movement, that shit is halfway bizarre. I'm like, whoa, whoa, what? Like, you can't do none of that. Even when you're a gentleman, you still got to be bold. Like, even a gentleman would be like, nowadays you can't even open a door for a woman. You'd be like, I ain't ask you to open the door for me. I can open my own door. Like, oh, oh, okay. So it's like you don't you don't even know where to be. You don't even know how men don't know how to act nowadays, bro. It's like it's pushing niggas to just get a wife and call it a day, bro. <laughs> I think that's what they're trying to do to us, b. It's like you don't even have time to surface the field no more. You like shit, man. This shit ain't even worth it, man. You can't even cheat on your wife no more, cause I think that's the good thing about it. If you can, what's good, baby? <laughs> I was doing that to a dog, by the way. Whew, police, the dog, the dog. I was doing that to, but you can't even cheat on your wife no more now. They they coming out in drones, Bill Cosby and them. You gotta be careful. My bus is coming, by the way. I'm telling all your men and boys, especially the young men. I know your testosterone tell you a different story. But trust and believe when I tell you this, man. You gotta be. Sun is dripping out anyway. You gotta be careful on how you move out here. Right, I'm gonna holler at y'all later. Thanks. The same bus. All the time. Every time. You know how I know? I left that. So I know. Come on, man. This nigga is the worst. Look at this bus driver, yo. He came um, 10 minutes late and he's out of the bus talking on the phone. Some people, yo, it's crazy, but yeah, when you talking to a girl nowadays, this shit is crazy, because it's like, yo, this nigga is very unprofessional, yo, just look at this shit. I'm going to ask him just to be sure if this is the right bus. Play. Excuse me. This is the 120? This nigga gonna waste time and shit. Have these niggas play with you. You know what I mean? This is, it is the right bus too, but I don't know what's going on. Niggas 10 minutes late and he's out there trying to make a phone call. Look at him. Look at him, yo. Making a phone call, looking at his phone. Shit crazy. But back to the story, man. Yeah, I gotta be careful how I move out here with these bitches, you feel me? You do, man. Cause they can say any and everything. She could be allowing it. And one day she could be like, nope. You feel me? And the way you guys treat girls, y'all gotta I guess it's a good thing in a way, cause some of these guys just be walking all over these girls and that's not a good thing you're not supposed as a man don't, don't don't ever put your hands on a woman i don't care if society allow you to do it don't do it man you gotta be better than that it's like there's no excuse for such things i can't even entertain it i think it's sad you feel me seeing saying things like that you know, i think people actually know what i'm what I'm talking to, he's mad now. Just hurry up and do your job. Um, it's gonna be a whole traffic anyway. You gonna have a lot of time to wait. Trust me. You gonna have a whole lot of time to talk on your phone. A whole lot of traffic is coming up. Anyway, um, yeah. As a man, don't put your do not put your hand on anybody who do not want you, to, especially women. And she said no, no means no. When I say hands, I'm talking about beating her in any form or shape. You feel me? Only if you're in a relationship with her, you got to affirm yourself. Do not hit her. Just, you know, be stern with it. That's all. Be stern and just, you know, give her your reassurance. That's all. 
but I'm out of here, man. Let me let me see what's going on out here. Cause feminine shit got niggas fucked up. I can't even. I be looking. She be looking good. But I can't even talk. I be like, yeah, I don't wanna. I be like, can I even approach? It's like you gotta be like, hey, I am approaching you to speak to you. <laughs> You gotta talk to her in that format. Like, hey, how you doing? Um, can I approach you and speak to you? <laughs> like, like that shit is weird. Like, that's some weird talk. But I guess we gotta practice that. You know what I mean? Do we have to? I can't talk to a female like that. <laughs> it's making a. That's another form. They're trying to train us to demasculate us. You feel me? Anyway, I'm out of here. Ah, uh, look.